Right, so Meet Crayons and a couple of other channels got demonetized a couple of weeks ago, and apparently it's got to do with this. Uh, there is a new rule on YouTube where it says you're not allowed to use family-friendly cartoons, including Thomas the Tank Engine and other similar... You're not allowed to use them in a way that's frightening, in a way that has, like, sexual connotations. Um, and if you do, then your entire channel can uh, get demonetized. Uh, so this is why it happened to Meet Crayons. And, and the reason is, like, the moral panic that the mainstream media is creating, which is absolutely ridiculous. Like, clearly those channels weren't even dedicated for children, but you're not allowed to use the cartoons. And, and look, look how annoying it is, right? Like, a Tennessee mother has warned other parents to monitor YouTube kids. Like, no fucking shit you should monitor social media. Like, first of all, first of all, your, your children should not be on social media, period, until they're at least 14 years of old. And, and uh, between 14 and 18 or, eight, you know, like 16, let's be lenient. Between those ages, you should supervise them. Like, you, sh you shouldn't just let your kid be on the freaking internet unsupervised. It's so freaking ridiculous. They could watch my channel, for example. Could hear me say fuck. But anyway, so... <clears throat> apparently, it's it's our two-year-old son, right? Like, imagine this. Like, you, you give your two-year-old child access to the internet. Are you a parent? Like, what are you doing? Did, did you ever hear about the concept of parenting? Like, you, should, you should not just allow them to be on the internet. So apparently she's a makeup artist and uh, she issues stark wording because uh, there, there's a demonic Thomas the Tank Engine and it's like, this? Okay, fine, whatever. I, 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 can't, I, I have seen worse, but this book that, okay. So uh, apparently um, he says, I'm gonna chug, I'm gonna choo-choo as he glides down the thing. Uh, many parents might have thought that the next line is, I've got a delivery to do, but uh, apparently he says, uh, I've got to kill a lot of you. And uh, th this is the problem. Um, this is the, the moral scandal. Uh, this shocked the, the mother. And, and, and I, I want to point out, okay, I grew up not, not with video games, uh, not with TV shows. I grew up with stories. Right, like, like uh, ancient fairy tales, the Grimm brothers, uh, Cinderella. At the end of the story, the two sisters, th they have their foot cut off in order to try and fit it in the shoe. Um, th there, there are other stories where the villain is made to, to wear iron shoes that are heated in fire and they dance until they die, you know, like that type of stuff. Uh, if you actually look a little bit at some older folklore, uh, for example, uh, The Little Mermaid, like after she changes into her human form, apparently her feet hurt really bad, like, like she's stepping on needles, but the prince doesn't even acknowledge her, and, and she ends up throwing herself off a cliff. Like that that's the type of stories that our grandparents grew up with. You know, Little Red Riding Hood, like, she actually gets raped by the wolf because the story is actually about warning little girls not to trust strangers. Like, that's the original one. Uh, you know, you, you get, for example, Sleeping Beauty. Uh, she doesn't get a kiss to wake up. No, no, no. The, the prince has sex with her and is the labor of childbearing that wakes her up. Like, like, these were the stories that our grandparents grew up with, right? And apparently they ended up fine. Or did they? I mean, you know, maybe this is why we had World War One and Two. And uh, now everyone is freaked out. Oh, my God. Like, there, there's, like, this Thomas the Tank Engine thing. And, you know, like, he, he says bad things and it's demonic. Is it, though? It's just like the, the worst mortal panic ever. Let, let's see what people are saying in the comment section. I'm genuinely curious. So, go Karen, yes. Well, congratulations. You know, you, you actually got talented people demonetized. Like, Meet Canyons, really the awesome channel. You know, he puts a lot of work into doing that. Makes some really creepy and disturbing videos. But, like, you know, there are people who want creepy and disturbing. It's definitely not for children. Like, he's making stuff for adults. 
But it is what it is. You know, we can't have nice things. Hilaria, show them a video of Boris Johnson. That is truly terrifying. Uh, don't you just love when Karen is pearl clutching? And, and it's not just that Karen is pearl clutching. It's the fact that the media is reporting on this, right? Like they're creating a moral panic over this Karen. Anyway, right, let me know what you guys think. And uh, as usual, I will see you in the comment section. Take care.